tragic. There was a car that had struck our bus uh, head on collision. There were flames and lots of debris when I first showed up. Superintendent of Chippewa Hill School, Dr. Bob Grover, rushed to the scene after receiving a call late Thursday night that one of his school buses was involved in a serious accident. My first fear obviously was are the kids okay? Heading back to Remus after a game in Freeland, 21 Chippewa Hills High School students from the JV football team were aboard the bus when it collided with a car on Coldwater Road, north of River Road, just outside Mount Pleasant. Three students were treated for minor injuries and released from a local hospital. Two staff members on the bus also received minor injuries. However, the driver of the car died at the scene. Police not releasing that person's identity at this time, but Dr. Grover says Sadly, this was a former student. We have some pretty good information from our families around the area of who it is. Uh, unfortunately, it is one of our previous graduates. The accident is still under investigation, but according to the Isabella County Sheriff's Office, a female driving a Chevy Impala crossed over to the opposite lanes, causing a head-on collision with the bus. Upon impact, the car burst into flames. Soon after, the bus also caught fire. Dr. Grover says this could have been much worse and credits his staff for their quick action. The two coaches that were on the bus, who, by the way, did a phenomenal job of getting those kids off safe and accounting for everybody, making sure everything was, you know, taken care of. In Isabella County, April Morton, WNEM-TV5.